What's up guys, this is Massey, welcome to my channel. In this video I want to show you some examples regarding solving radical expressions. First example is square root of q minus 2 plus 3 equals to square root of 4q plus 1. Answer will be... So we need to square both sides. It's going to be q minus 2 plus 3 to the power of 2 equals to square root of 4q plus 1 to the power of 2. Then it will be square root of q minus 2 to the power of 2 plus 3 to the power of 2 plus 6 root q minus 2 equals to 4q plus 1. Because 2 and square root cancel each other. Then here it will be the 2 and square root cancel each other is going to be q minus 2 plus 9 plus 6 root q minus 2 equals to 4q plus 1. Then if you simplify it, you have 4q plus 1. And here you have q plus 7 plus 6 root q minus 2. Then you can say q, bring it here, is going to be 3q. And here you have 1 minus 7 equals to 6 root q minus 2. Then we can say here 6 root q minus 2 equals to 3 q minus 2 and then 3 and 6 cancel out and will remain 2 so we have 2 root q minus 2 equals to q minus 2 then what you can do you can square both sides it will be 4 root q minus 2 squared q minus 2 squared it will make it to 4 q minus 2 the 4 is coming from 2 squared equals to q squared plus 4 minus 4 q then we can say 4 q minus 8 equals to q squared plus 4 minus 4 q then I move everything to the right hand side it will be q squared plus 4 minus 4q minus 4q plus 8. It changes to q squared minus 8q plus 12 equals to 0. q squared minus 8q plus 12 equals to 0. So now we need to factor that. So we have we have negative 2 and negative 6. Negative 2 times negative 6 is going to be positive 12. Negative 2 and negative 6, when we add them, it's going to be negative 8. So it's going to be q minus 2, q minus 6 equals to 0. So q will be either equal to 2 and 6. So this is the final answer. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please leave me a comment if you have any question and I get back to you as soon as possible. And please don't forget to subscribe this channel. Thank you.